Hi, this is Navdeep from Delhi Immigration Services. Today we have Ms. Navpreet with us. So we got the Canada study visa after one refusal. And we'll just talk to her and see how her overall profile is and how she's become a successful candidate. Uh, Ms. Navpreet, many congratulations to you, ma'am, first of all, for the approval. Uh, great news. Thank you so much, sir. It's all because of you. Thank you very much. And uh, thanks to God uh, that it happened. Uh, can you also uh, take us through your academic background? You worked there as well. And then for which program you applied for the first time and, um, you know, how you prepared for everything? Uh, I have done my plus two in medical stream. Then I have chosen bachelor's of, uh, bachelor's of science in nutrition and dietetics in 2012. And I completed that in two, 2016. After that, I chose a master's uh, in 2016 and uh, completed that in 2018. After that, immediately I joined in a company uh, as a dietitian and still I was working. I just left two, three days ago. Uh, my first uh, course was uh, business and beverage management uh, from um, Niagara College, right. but I got refusal. Before right. that, I even visited many agents so that I can get a good uh, course for me. But unfortunately, no one was good in that. No one suggested me good course. But uh, after getting refusal, I was so broken. Like I was blank. What should be the next step? I was not aware, like, where should I go? Then my brother uh, talked about my refusal with someone and he told me about you. Oh. And then my brother said, I should go with you. He he was having a like 100% definite trust on you that you can do that. So I said, okay, I should go with you. And finally, today I got the good news. So it's very good for me. Many congratulations for you, ma'am, uh, to you for this. And uh, uh, since you mentioned that you previously applied for the business uh, beverage management, um, so you have seen now the both of the applications. So what do you think we have done differently, uh, you know, that this time you got the visa? According to you, what are your learnings of the process? In this process, I saw that your SOP was amazing. Like, I read their SOP uh, and here it completely expressed why the person wants to go, why he chose this course. Right. Everything was very deeply elaborated, which was best thing so that right. you don't need other documents. Right. And in my previous time, I have to show all the documents like my savings, my father's uh, work, uh, earning and all that, everything we show. Yeah. Uh, but nothing happened nothing right. happened by giving all the documents but in uh, when i go with you and i don't need to submit any other document it was like your sop was so strong that there is no other document required to support the file so right. this was the best thing right thank you very much and uh, this time uh, you know you are going for entrepreneurship management at canada college and uh, you have been working uh, as a clinical dietitian uh, and uh, yeah this time so you got the visa very very happy for you ma'am that it happened and overall uh, many many congratulations and thank you for sharing your experience with us thank you for your time as well i wish you all the best for your next uh, steps in life in canada ma'am all the very best take care